you know what? I haven't done one of these for quite a while. And it's, I don't know what time it is. It's like <laughs> midnight or so. Um, so fuck it. Let's do it. Look at my boys. There's boy number one, boy number two. Salem, Salem. Hi, baby. Hello. Being a little Sweeney Pie. Being a little precious boy. <laughs> uh, so I figured I would show you guys uh, some of my plants. Because why not, right? <laughs> so let's see if I can figure this out. So uh, here I've got my little seedling station right now. Got some lavender and I've got some catnip and um, I don't quite know how they're doing. Um, I mean they're still alive so that's something. Here I have some basil growing and some uh, special breed of rose that I got seeds for like ages ago and I have absolutely no idea if they will sprout but uh we'll see I guess <laughs> then here we are in my absolute favorite room and it's got just so many lovely plants this is my amaryllis this one makes such lovely flowers it just it makes these big old red blooms and it's just it's beautiful and hopefully it'll rebloom again at some point this is my gardenia and look it's growing new little leaves look at it go look at it go yes i mean let me tell you at one point when i left it in someone else's care it it was on the verge of dying <laughs> It had almost no leaves, so the fact that it's grown so much and continues to grow just makes me so, so happy. This is one of my favorite plants. Um, it grows these little, like, inverted flowers, and it's so pretty, and it's a cyclamen, and it just is constantly growing new ones. You can see little tiny buds. Uh, this is a camellia, which is apparently supposed to bloom at some point. Um, we'll see when that happens. Uh, ignore that. That's dead. That does not have basil in it. <laughs> uh, this one also was a case of I left it in someone else's care and basically everything died or like all the leaves fell off. So this is a lot of progress for it. This is a little baby orchid that I got off of one of our bigger orchids downstairs. There are some air plants. There's me. Hi. <laughs> this is my lovely, lovely statue of Aphrodite surrounded by flowers and plants, which, you know, I'm asking her to bless my stuff, please. This is a uh, palm that my parents got me. Um, and it's in the process of putting out a new leaf, so that's really exciting. Here we have the sun-loving plants. We've got two desert roses. This one was a gift from a pet, thank you pet. And uh, two roses that I'm trying to grow indoors. You can see this one's got little leaves growing. These are actually uh, attempt number two because I was getting a lot of root rot first time, which I'm not going to get into because I don't think you guys care, but basically this is my second attempt and I've been keeping close eye on them for bugs because oh my god, I hate aphids so much. And yeah, that's uh, most of my plants without getting fully into it. I mean, there's also the ones over here, this one that I've had for like five years, and this one that will hopefully not die like the other two attempts have, but you know, shit happens. And also if you're asking what that whirring noise is, it's this thing. Um, <laughs> it catches all the little fungus gnats that annoy me endlessly and torment me. It sucks them all in and it doesn't let them out ever. <laughs> 
here I've got my setup that I've been working on for a while. Trying to get this thing all right is really, really time consuming, <laughs> to say the least. Um, but I have this webcam that I used for the last stream, and then I also have my lovely microphone that I sometimes like to stroke while I'm talking because why not? And then I've got my little desk webcam that I use to show you guys the nebula. And yeah, uh, so I'm hoping to be able to bring more content more frequently um, while trying to find the balance between wanting to have, wanting to feel not pressured to make content and allowing myself to just make things while also not feeling like I'm forcing myself to make things and it's a very very delicate balance so <laughs> working on it I do want to make clips soon and part of why I haven't really done that a lot is because um I don't know I get stuck on the dumbest things and with clips right now, I'm stuck on feeling like I'm not experienced or good enough with editing. So, you know what? I guess I'll start vlogging more so that I can get more comfortable with <laughs> editing and, you know, seeing how it goes. And hopefully that'll get that flow easier to get into and to maintain. That's... It's been really <laughs> kind of hectic lately. Well, not so much hectic. <laughs> Hi, let's get real intimate here. Um, not so much that it's hectic, it's just I feel like I'm working on so many different things at once. And I'm just kind of trying to sort through it one by one without letting myself get overwhelmed because that's very easy to do unfortunately um been doing some health stuff some mental stuff been working on a lot of business stuff in a sense um and just trying to promote myself to be the best that i can be just like I hope that you guys are being the best that you can for me. But even though I've been kind of busy with all that and I haven't felt like I've been making a whole lot, um, I do still interact quite a lot. Um, I, you know, I talk online um, with the community that I've made and with, you know, the sex work community and fandom community and hypno community. I, I try to interact very frequently and sometimes I have to remind myself that it's okay if not a lot happens today or you know tomorrow or whatever it's okay if I haven't posted a lot it's okay if I haven't you know made 10 million tweets or whatever or haven't posted any pictures that's fine and I can just take it at my own pace and I I really, really like that. And I, it's something that I really appreciate about this line of work. So, hopefully, <laughs> I can be able to kind of work on that and not exactly take it off of my list because it's really something that's just kind of ongoing. And if you don't know, the thing that I'm working on right now in terms of being more productive, uh, sorry, my arm got tired, <laughs> is I've been trying to stream every Thursday. I haven't limited myself to streaming in one place every Thursday, so it might be on YouTube, it might be on Chatterbait, I might do something on Discord or something. It, it just depends. So if you want to know specifically where I'm going that day, best way to check is like Twitter. Uh, I'll post it on Tumblr too. Um, but the very best way is, I'll, I'll link it below, but I, I wrote a little 
thing about it, uh, basically through the Wix app and getting onto my little, it's not really a forum, I don't know, my little area on the Wix app, I can send out push notifications for when I'm starting to stream and where I'm starting to stream. So if you want to catch me doing anything, that's the best way to know how, because other than that, it might be kind of random, because scheduling is not a thing that I'm good at. That's all for this vlog. Now I have to try to go edit it in a way that I am somewhat satisfied with, and at least feel like I'm learning something. <laughs> that's all for now. I'll be seeing you guys later. Bye, pets.